Now, in Baltimore City Public Schools, the pace of infections has slowed. However, there were 128 new ones in the past 10 days, and a vaccine mandate is now in effect for employees. WJZ is live at City School Headquarters. Avajoy Burnett has more on how they're enforcing that. Avajoy. Mike, well, now that the vaccines are readily available, there are many school districts that are requiring that all of their employees get the shot, and that's the case here for Baltimore City Public Schools. For people who don't get the shot and they don't get that regular testing, there could be some really tough consequences, like losing your job. After a six-week buildup, the deadline is here. All Baltimore City Public School employees must get the COVID-19 vaccine or do regular testing. If I were a parent, which I'm not, um, I would be very apprehensive to send my child to school if everybody wasn't vaccinated. City schools said for employees who don't have a medical or religious exemption, there could be harsh consequences like losing their jobs. That could go up to termination, but that's not our goal. Out of the city's 5,200 teachers, 90% of them are vaccinated. WJZ also checked in with other districts, and here's how things stand. Howard County says all staff must get vaccinated or take weekly tests. More than 90% of the staff are fully vaccinated. Harford County doesn't require the shot, but 52% of teachers who live in the district are vaccinated. Carroll County doesn't require a shot either, but the district said 85 Five percent of staff got the shot. It's a safety precaution. So I, you know, I, that's how I look at it. Like, you know, it's, it's, it's something that should be done. While some people believe the choice to get the shot should be a personal one, it's a choice for them. They have to figure out what's important. Others think getting vaccinated is a no-brainer. I think it's ridiculous, and, and enough is enough of this foolishness. You know, we need to be firm that this is a life-saving safety measure, and we all need to do it. And we got some new information in from Baltimore County Public Schools. They said 95% of their employees either submitted their vaccine status or signed up to get regular testing. Live tonight in Baltimore City, Avajoy Burnett for WJZ.